Hey ladies, it's Samantha Thompson, your Executive Director with 31, and if you're in the Back to Basics training program, congratulations. You're really making an awesome effort towards your business. If you're not, I kind of wanted to tell those of you who aren't in it um, what we're doing this week and what we've been working on just because I think it's absolutely fabulous. And for me, um, one of the things I think I've always done pretty well is my hostess um, packets and my guest packets. But this is kind of revolutionizing um, the way that I do things, and I think it's really going to um, be successful and um, really help out. So I'm going to show you guys what we did, and you're welcome to do this too if you want. You don't have to be in back to basics in order to do this. But um, basically, we got these poly folders and they've got kind of that plastic on them so they hold up much better than the paper folders. You can get these at Walmart. Um, they have some that are 77 cents. I got five star ones that are, um, they were like $1.38 a piece. You can order them online. I actually ordered a bunch of ones in black and I'm going to put the pink 31 sticker that you can get from Business Supply on them. But it doesn't really matter what color you get um, but, or which kind you get. But they're not that expensive. And basically, this is going to be my new hostess packet. And because it's got that plastic on there, it's going to last much longer than a regular folder. And um, I used to do like the um, clear frosted bags with all my stuff in there. But I really actually think this is better. And I think it's going to work better for my host and also help me with hostess coaching. So inside this front pocket, I have a hostess checklist, and I can put all these documents on um, our Team Thompson page if you guys want, but this basically helps my hostess earn up to $30 off her order. Now here's what she has to do to do that. The first one, um, to get $5 off her order, she has to find me on Facebook, invite her friends to the Facebook event that I create for her, or you can have her create her own Facebook event, however you want to do it. I personally like to create the Facebook events myself because then I get the wording in there correctly. I know I'm a um, host of that event. I can post a picture at the top, etc. Um, and then the second thing she has to do is tag me in a post on her personal page telling everyone about the, her party and giving um, them my website link. So that's a great way, um, you know, of course you can't post your own website link um, on Facebook, but your customers can. So that's a great way to get that advertising um, for you. Um, the second one is that she has to send me the names and addresses of 10 VIP guests and um, I put um, this address label sheet in there for her. It's just a regular Avery address label sheet and I highlighted the first 10. So those are the 10 she has to do to get $5 off her order, but it says in there that I've encouraged her to fill out the entire sheet. And then I can put these on mini catalogs and mail them. I can put them on um, basically these 10 I'm going to actually send a full catalog to um, and, and a couple order forms and ask them to collect a couple outside orders and bring to the party for her. Um, but you can do it however you want. And you can also order these um, address labels. There's a place online to order them where they're like a triplicate copy um, so that you have a copy to put in your back office. But if not, just photocopy this. You know, put it on your printer, make a copy um, before you send it out, and then that way you have those contacts to put in your back office. Um, the third thing she has to do is, this is for home parties only. She can get up to $10 off, um, $5 for $100 in order she collects, or $10 if she collects $200 before her show. As a bonus, she can get a $10 gift certificate for each person. She gets to book a party before the show starts for a home show or by the time she closes for a catalog party. So that's a great way to get her to work for you to get bookings. And then she can get $5 off by finding 20 friends that would be like to be added to my monthly customer email. They'll be the first to see the new catalog and get, you know, updates from the outlet sales. So I put this sheet in there for her. Um, and then... I also have this 40 guests in 40 minutes in there, and that kind of goes along with this address label, so it helps her come up with her guest list, and that's all detailed on this sheet. And then the last thing it says, um, she gets $5 off her order if she finds me on Pinterest, and it has my Pinterest site, and then um, she can check out my 31 hostess appetizers, and then also my summer 2014 products. Now, what happens is when she repins my summer products, I make sure on my pins it has my website address, not 31's website address, not some other consultant who pinned it first. It's my website address. So when she repins this, if her friends see it and they click it, they're going to my at my um, website. So that's a great way to get your hostess to work for you. And trust me, if she does these things, you know, I'm more than happy to pay $30 of her order because 
that's a fantastic way to um, get some advertising for me. Then um, I have the plastic um, sheet protectors, and in here I have a customer special. So this is a hostess packer June, so it has the June customer special. This is um, the order form guideline, so it just tells them how to fill out an order. This says how to invite guests to the Facebook event, so it teaches them how to do that. If you don't want to um, create the event, you can put an instruction sheet on how to create a Facebook event. Um, and then it has some embroidery ideas. It has the Living Your Dreams flyer, my why letter, and then I have this, this or that flyer. And like I said, I can put all of this stuff on the team page for you guys if you want to make these. And then in this back pocket, you're going to put um, order forms and one catalog for your hostess to keep. And then um, you're going to give her this along with several other catalogs. You know, I like to do five. You could do up to eight if you're just starting out. And you don't have a lot, you could do three. But this is my new um, hostess packets. And what I'm doing is creating ten of these. Um, and so I have them for all summer long, and I'm set. I don't have to recreate this. Every time I get a booking, I have these ready to go. When I have a party, I can even put them in my car. And if I happen to book a party on the go, I'm ready to go. And this works for catalog parties, home parties, Facebook parties, etc. So um, works fabulous and helps you kind of save time and be more prepared. So if you just make these up at the beginning of catalog season, you don't have a lot whole of stuff to change out. You can just change out your monthly special flyers and that's it. You can um, update your letter as needed or, you know, your um, living your dreams flyer as needed. But it's a great way to do your hostess packets. If you guys have any questions, let me know. If you're interested in doing this and you want the finals, let me know and I'll upload them. Thanks, ladies. Have a great day.